A big IT company regularly recruits large number of fresh graduate candidates and inducts them into the company as trainees. As part of the induction process, five month training is undergone by the candidates. The candidates must attend the course and appear for a test at the end of each subject. Once the candidates have been selected, they are formed into batches depending on the specializations. A training calendar is prepared by the training executive and trainers are identified both internal and external. The trainers conduct training on their respective topics, conduct a test at the end of the topic and submit the results to the training executive. This includes setting of paper, correction of answer sheets and preparing the necessary reports. One of the areas of major friction is the testing of the candidates. The trainer may get biased and set the paper based not on the course coverage but based on what he or she has covered. May set the paper very easy. Some trainers being external trainers may not really take the testing as an essential activity. The training department also ends up with a lot of paperwork. Human biases may creep in. Too many complaints from the candidates regarding the paper correction etc. creates unnecessary friction and associated paperwork. It has been decided to take up this aspect of the training process for automation. Conduct of the training programs in terms of scheduling, tracking would be currently out of scope. So this is the uh, initial write-up on the existing system. And uh, uh, it has also been uh, decided in the last par paragraph that the testing will be, testing of the candidates will be looked at for further study. Now, and it is already decided that the automation would play a major role in improving the testing process. Proposed solution. The training manager will specify the subjects and who can create or modify questions and answers in the system. The questions will be created by employees added as experts in this system. The questions once and added will be reviewed by other experts of the same subject. Only once a question has been approved will it be available for testing. To incentivize the process, each expert shall be given an incentive of some amount per question added and an incentive of some amount per question reviewed. The necessary information regarding who has created and who has approved shall be maintained in the system. A subject shall be available for scheduling of tests only after a predefined number of questions have been added, reviewed and approved. The training executive is responsible for scheduling the test. Once scheduling has been done, the candidates must be informed about the schedule of test automatically. The schedule so sent shall include the login and password specifically for the test. The candidate will be able to take up a test and review their results. Each participant will be asked unique set of questions. The number of questions to be asked shall be the same for a subject. The time allotted for the test shall also be the same for a subject. In case of a crash, the system should restart from where it crashed only during the test. Once a test is complete, the system shall immediately evaluate the result and communicate the same to the candidate through email. The passing percentage is subject specific but shall not be less than 70%. It is possible that in future the same system would be used for testing new recruits as part of the recruitment process. So this is the proposed solution. So this is the problem statement and this is the proposed solution.